New at 10, one in three women in Arkansas face physical violence from a partner. That's according to the National Coalition Against Domestic Violence. And finding a new home is sometimes one of the biggest obstacles. But as Jessica Rank shows us, one local organization is building a new foundation to change that. Literally, Jessica. Yeah. Laura, well, Women's Own Worth is a nonprofit right here in central Arkansas, and they have just broke ground on their first set of homes for women in Bryant. The homes giving the family four walls, but more importantly, a place where they can finally feel safe. Jawan Archer walks an empty lot with a single mailbox and a big dream. So this is going to be where the four corners are. The walls built won't be home to her family. This is going to be the first unit and the second unit is right next to it. But instead, a safe space to rebuild a foundation. I've lived this and I know what these ladies are going through. Archer is a domestic violence survivor. They came back within a week and kidnapped me with a 30 6 from my home with my children there. Archer was able to escape, now helping other women do the same. On this lot, four homes will be built, all for families escaping domestic violence. There's a huge fear factor when you're dealing with someone who is abusive. Susanna Watts, also a domestic violence survivor. Leaving takes a lot of courage because they convince you and manipulate you into thinking that they will find you no matter where you go. She says a home and support are two of the most important things when escaping these situations. Many women find themselves without. There's a lot of reasons why people don't leave, and we want to give them a reason to leave. Nearly 500 victims in Arkansas sought shelter with domestic violence programs, many with a short-term lease. What is the lady and their family going to do after 30 days? They're going to go back. These will last two years, with the hope the house won't just be four walls. It's not a hand out, it's a hand up. But a first step to a new life. Now, Archer says the project wouldn't have been possible without the help and support of the community. The houses are expected to be completed in the next few months with more hopefully on the way. If you or someone you know is in need of help, you can always call the National Domestic Violence Hotline 1-800-799-SAFE. Live in studio, I'm Jessica Rank for KARK4 News. Laura.